Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna. If you're new here, I do makeup reviews, makeup tutorials, skincare, anything beauty related. I got you covered. Today's video, I'm excited. There's a new launch from Flower Beauty and I saw them tease it a couple of weeks ago and I was like, oh my god, this is so exciting. So we're going to talk about that today. They recently launched what's called their Spotlight Liquid Highlighter. Which, I don't know about you, but that name sounds an awful familiar to another product. So here are the two products. Um, so they launched in three shades. I got two out of the three. In this video, I'm going to give you quick details about this product. I'm going to swatch. I'm going to try it on. And I'm going to compare it to Charlotte Tilbury's Beauty Light Wand in Spotlight. So if that's something you're interested in watching, definitely hang around. And let's get started. So they teased, Flower Beauty, teased that they were having a couple of launches this month and I spotted this so quick in their Instagram post. Um, it's called their Spotlight Liquid Highlighter. This do retail for $13, which is about the normal price point for Flower Beauty. I would say they're, um, they're not super, super affordable. Like they're affordable because they're at the drugstore, but it's not like Wet n Wild's price point. It's somewhat around like NYX's price point. Um, maybe Neutrogena's price point, just for a reference. So, three shades. They launched the shade called Gilded, which is a bronze highlight. The shade Rose Gold. Uh, I'm sorry, Gleam, which is a rose gold. And Opal, which is a white gold highlight. It says here, I'm just going to read off of my phone, a Radiant Pearlescent Glow, Dewy Radiant Finish, infused with moisturizing goji berries and cranberry seeds. Um, features a built-in cushion applicator and it's optical soft focus effect so the reason I made that face about the cushion applicator is because if you have Charlotte Tilbury or you've seen Charlotte Tilbury's highlighter you're gonna recognize this little thing here now this is not my favorite type of applicator so we'll see how it works but that's what we're working with. So here are the two shades. And I'm going to swatch them for you. So this is same same thing as the Charlotte. It has a little part here where it says off and then you turn it. So I'm going to turn it to on. I'm going to squeeze very gently. Okay, I can see it already coming through the top. I'm going to swatch shade Gleam first. Let me just get into focus. That is a gleam. And then I'm going to take opal, which is that pale gold. So those are the two shades. Honestly, while I'm looking at this, um, this pinky one, it kind of a little bit reminds me of pink as well. So I'm just going to turn this way. So again, this is Opal and Gleam. And since we have the other Charlotte one, I'm going to just swatch it next to it. I'm actually going to swatch it next to the Opal one that I swatched. This is the Charlotte Tilbury in Spotlight. Opal Gleam. So these two are probably closer in color. I would say that the Charlotte Tilbury one is a true champagne kind of gold color. I'm just going to kind of blend them and see how they feel. Ooh, okay, so this one, the first one I swatched, kind of dried down, and it's not moving. So that's interesting. I, I wasn't expecting it to, like, sit. So it seems like you have a few minutes to play around with it before it completely sets, and it'll stay. This one is starting to dry down. This is opal. And then this is the Charlotte. And honestly, when I'm turning my hands, my hand, it has the exact same gleam on all of them. This is all three on my fingers. So that's a pretty close dupe. I'm going to start applying them to my face now. I'm going to take shade Opal. And I'm going to put it over here. Oh, okay. <laughs> that applies a lot. So same thing with the Charlotte, if you're used to it. 
um, squeeze out a little bit and then lock it because you don't want it to be messy. That is really beautiful. Oh my goodness. And let me tell you, this is about $30 cheaper than uh, Charlotte Tilbury. So, that was opal. And a little bit goes a long way. Don't squeeze it too hard. I have a ton on the back of my hand right now that I'm not going to use. Now I'm going to take Gleam and I'm going to put that on the top of this cheek. That is really pretty too. Wow. That's pretty. That's a true like rose gold highlighter. This one is a nice, like, it says, like, a white gold highlight. Oh, my goodness. That's crazy. Okay. We're going to take Charlotte, and I'm going to apply it over here just so we can kind of compare. That is insane how close these are. Wow. That's the Charlotte Spotlight, and this is the Flower Beauty. That is such a dupe. It's insane. That is crazy. I almost feel like um, the Flower Beauty is just a little more, a little more fluid, I guess, than the Charlotte one. So that's really cool. Something that I'm curious to see now is I'm actually going to take that um, Flower one. And I'm going to just put it on my cheek and blend it out just to kind of see how it sits on like a larger surface area. It's really pretty. It just gives like my whole cheek such a pretty glow. It's not giving me like Tin Man kind of glow. It's not really emphasizing any texture that I have on my face. Let me pull you in. See? It's just like as I turn the light catches my cheek. Like, granted, you're not going to put highlighter all over your cheek like that. Or you can, and then put, like, um, blush or something. But that's super pretty. Let me take some down the bridge of my nose. Okay, maybe that was a little bit too much. But that's gorgeous. Look at that. Let me pull you out so you're not, like, so you can kind of see the full effect. Like, that's really pretty. I definitely prefer the opal side over the gleam side. I think the gleam is going to be perfect than somebody who's like a true medium skin tone to tan. It's going to look really pretty. It's just pulling a little bit too dark for me right now. But if you're fair skin to like light medium, like early medium or, you know, the lightest of mediums or whatever, this color, um, opal, is going to be beautiful. Gleam, I feel like medium tan skin tones, and then that bronzy shade that I did not get, I feel like it's going to be great for somebody who's like tan to rich deep skin tone. Um, the other shades may pull a little bit ashy if you do have a rich deep skin tone. But overall, totally impressed. Now, I ordered mine off of Flower Beauty because that's the first place that it launched. Um, Delivery was really fast, but I think they deliver from like Kentucky or something like that and I live in Jersey So shipping took two days. I actually got my delivery on a Sunday. So that was amazing um, Yeah, overall thoughts. I think this is a great product. It's absolutely a dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury and it's way more affordable So go check it out. Let me know if you like it um, Tag me if you pick it up on Instagram or whatever or here yeah, and let me know. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it helpful, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.